Here I will discuss saving, deleting, and renaming rules in the Curve Machining Wizard. I'll start with feature recognition. Double click your pocket boundary curve. At the top of the wizard, you'll notice the curve name. For category, I'm going to choose pockets. The method will be type 2 for my approach. Three work steps were automatically loaded. These are my personal preferences as to how I would machine a pocket. Down below is information for each work step, such as pocketing, where we leave material on the walls and the pocket floor. The other two work steps are finish operations. I'm going to make a rule. Anytime a curve starts with P1 in its name, we will apply these work steps instantly. So I'm just going to delete the existing curves to demonstrate. We'll create a face curve, name it P1. Select the bottom of a pocket. And in a couple of clicks, you have these three work steps. If I want, I can rename the rule. For my next pocket, we'll call this EZ. And rule EZ was applied. And you can also delete rules.